No twirls, okay? I know you want to be a ballerina, but today you're going to be a reindeer, okay? Hello and welcome back to another episode of Hermitcraft Amplified. Today we are on the server and I'm super excited and pumped again. But today I don't have an awful lot of time to build so I am pretty worried about this episode. But I think I can, if I get, you know, down to it and I get my, uh, um, fitting gear? Is that even a saying? Um, I can get some stuff done. So the one thing that I really, really do need to build sometime soon is reindeer and a sleigh. Now this can be done in many different ways and I've been humming and hawing over whether or not I want to build it on the ground, you know, maybe add some cows or some horses. We could, I don't think anyone on the server's found horses so horses are just a massive no-no because you know, I don't have time to explore and try and find them and I, the fact that no one else has found them and lots of people have explored the area it kind of, kind of, I think probably ca uh, like the whole horses have probably just fallen down from the cliff just to their death basically which is which is not very nice uh you know since we've amplified terrain because i think plains are still very hilly uh which is where they spawn as well as other ones i think but anyway um so we could have it on the floor we could in fact have it here, along here i might have a couple of sleighs you know santa sometimes needs a backup sleigh so we might be able to build a couple of this episode one on the floor might be nicer here we could in fact just attach cows to it or something um because cows are pretty much reindeer if you think about it yeah, um, and uh, that could work very nicely indeed. We could also build one up in the sky. Now that one is going to be super, super hard to do. Um, but I kind of like the idea and I think it would look really cool in this terrain. Now, don't know if I want it up here in the sky because obviously over there isn't very snowy. Over here could be an option, but again, if the sleigh is going to be down here, it might not look great. I'm also thinking about whether or not I could build it at spawn. Now, spawn is a really cool place to build it because I probably could just set up something up there somewhere and build out, like at spawn on a tall mountain. Um, although a lot of the mountains and things are set taken. And also, I have seen a few things built at spawn that are, in fact, Christmas related already. So. Not 100% sure, I think I'll do some research, I'll have a look around at different places. But uh, one place I would really, really like to do it, what is here, you know, just up in the air. It's going to be really, really difficult to try and fit it in somewhere. Maybe, actually, thinking about it, it could be nice to put it up there, because there's loads of just blank sky behind it. Um, I really don't know, I think I'm going to have to just look around, decide on where I'm going to put it. Actually, look at spawn as well, because I think spawn would be a really cool place to build it. And uh, I'll come back to you guys when I've decided. So I've started planning out the slate, and this is what it's going to look like. Now the thing is, it is going to face this way, which is uh, maybe a bit of an issue, but I was thinking, facing this way, is that I've got more room over here. Now, over here would be where the reindeer are. Now, I'm not sure how I'm going to build the reindeer yet. Like I said, I'll either use cows or something like that. I can make some leads and stuff, um, and that could work. Or I can build them out of blocks, you know, basically like a little thing like this, pretty much, I guess. There we are, there we are, we have a reindeer, we'll put a little that's his eye, that's terrifying, uh, that is totally not a reindeer, but you know what I mean, so out of blocks, basically. It depends how big this is, if this is quite big, uh, which looks quite small at the moment, um, then maybe I'll just use cows, but we'll see how it goes, I guess. I could use pigs with... Um, uh, what are they called? Saddles on the backs, but um, I don't have any saddles, so that is a bit of an issue. But anyway, this is kind of how I'm thinking it's going to go. So I'm slowly building it up at the front. So this is going to be the way in. I think the, the way in should be right about the middle, a little bit nearer the front of the sleigh, and you should be able to walk in here. Now I'm going to need to put a seat in it, some more high up. So I think I'm going to play around a little bit more with this. We might, in fact, even. Uh, we could build it a little bit now. Um, I'm not sure exactly how this is going to work. Um, and do want to get this higher up at some point like that maybe um, and then maybe I could have some sort of I've got some fences um, holding this up from underneath um, a little bit I'm not quite sure just to make it look like it isn't just floating at the back I guess um, but I kind of thinking that this is how it's gonna look and I think they maybe could do some kind of um, a bit at the back where is that even in the same place I think so um, where it comes out one like so, like that or something. I think that'll be cool, but it does look like we might actually run out of red clay. 
So I do need to go and get some more red dye, um, or I could in fact just go to the Mesa Biome, which could be fun, um, and we'll go over there to collect some. But anyway, I'm going to play around with this a little bit more. We're going to try and get the shape right first, because it's kind of an awkward shape to build, but I think we're getting it pretty close to how it should look um, already, which is pretty pretty nice to, to see, I guess. So one thing I have just thought of is a really, really fun addition to the little sleigh. Now, I need to get a sign for this. I don't know whether or not I have one around. I probably don't. So let's quickly just make one um, or three, I guess. Um, and it might be really, really cute or pretty terrible. Um, but basically what I'm thinking is we need a little license plate on the back. Uh, I don't know, quite know what it's going to say. Yet. I guess it would say Santa or something on it. Um, we'll obviously change that. And then also... It could be cool if we put some like brake lights, I guess, on the back and we could also have something like that on the front. So this is a stable so far. We haven't done the interior or anything like that. I guess we could have the fog lights or some kind of lights down here. We should make them out of, I think, I think blue. I think the light blue might work because they're a bit frosted, you know, they're not quite white. Um, which I think is pretty cute. I could in fact actually move those up one. I'm not quite sure just yet, but that is pretty much what I've got. Now, I've put a little bit of a... A, a trim I guess around the back um, with the oak wood slabs which I think just adds a nice little touch um, but inside we have run out of clay as you can see um, we need to obviously build it up so what I'm planning is at the back of Santa today you usually have all the presents now with this I guess I'll just probably just put some double chests or maybe some single chests in here try and you can't really make them look scruffy you know they have to go in certain ways you know and you can't have them next to each other kind of thing so I guess I'll just put like a nice neat little um, storage area at the back there. Uh, we might block it off a little bit, maybe with some fences or, you know, something. Maybe a trap door so we can get in there, the back part. Um, and also we need some kind of chair. Now, I'm thinking, just imagine this is red clay for a second. I'm thinking the chair needs to go like up here or even just down one to there. Um, I think that'll look pretty cool. Um, let, we can actually add like a little chair there. And I think that's probably like the right height. Um, and he could have like a little staircase up to it almost because obviously, you know, this sleigh is pretty big You do need to have, you know, a little bit of a, a better viewpoint We could in fact actually even I don't know if it'll be too cheesy. It could be too cheesy We could add a little bit of a windshield going on <laughs> I think that's probably gonna be too cheesy, but we could also add like a little bit of a top on it, I guess um, Like so I think that might be a bit much that might be a bit much, but um, it is quite a cute little touch in fact we could even just quickly give a little touch of um, a touch of these at the sides, just so that it kind of works a little bit better. Maybe let's do a bit of parkour. Uh, let's have a look at what that looks like from down here. It doesn't look too bad, actually. It looks pretty funny. <laughs> I mean, this is supposed to be like a little comedy thing. It's not supposed to be amazing, um, but I do think it looks pretty much like a sleigh, which is pretty good. So we're gonna probably tweak things a little bit more. We're gonna probably gro go and grab some red dye or red clay. And I think I may have just got stuck in the sleigh, which is not helpful. Definitely want, don't want to be doing that um, inside the sleigh. That's probably quite bad. Well, here we are, Santa's sleigh. Now, it is a bit of an odd shape, but I think once I've got the uh, animals or whatever's going to go in front, I think it'll look cool. I've done the uh, the number plates. It says Santa and then it says North Pole because some, some license plates, I'm pretty sure, say the country or have a flag on it or something like that and I just done it I don't know I just thought that looked better anyway I'm thinking I'm gonna add some carpet I'm not quite sure exactly how this should work whether we should have it like so uh, like that that might be quite nice just to kind of keep it quite homely you know Santa obviously spends a lot of time in his sleigh going to deliver presents to everyone um so I thought you know that works probably a lot better than I guess it should do oh that that's cool, I like that. He's got like a little foot mat. Um, because when he's, you know, driving his sleigh, he, he can't quite see very well, but I'm sure he uses F5. He can see where he's going, he's like, you know, sitting here, like, just, um, going everywhere, which is fun. So, yeah, that's what I've done. I've put the chests in, in this kind of fashion. I think that works pretty well. And I don't think there's anything I'm missing. Now, if there is, be sure to let me know. I was thinking about adding some furnaces or something, not sure exactly. Um, but let's do something like that as well. Just keep it symmetrical. I can't I, I do really like symmetry I know it's in my name. So yeah, I, do, I just do sometimes um, Which is why I had to put two torches up here rather than just one just to keep it a little bit lighter I was gonna use jack-o'-lanterns or something, but I think the torches just add 
you know, they're just quite nice. Um, I was also thinking I need to add something to the side, like some kind of pattern or something. I'm not sure. Um, also, I did, ha I did have some, uh, some vines I was going to put on it, but I'm thinking I could just make it look quite nice just by putting a few little, uh, um, just leaves everywhere, you know? Uh, just make it look like it's been here a little while or so, you know? I just, like, Santa's left it here for a while. Which he has, you know, this is his spare sleigh. Um, and I think that'll look cool. So I'm gonna add the little, uh, fellas in front, the reindeer. Um, and hopefully that'll look cool. And, uh, yeah, I haven't quite decided what I'm gonna do yet. The one thing I should really do, which might take a bit more work than you might think, there are cows down there. But there are also cows on, it, like, the edge of the cliffs that I'm on. So, like, the cliffs, like, down there, or... Or something. There's probably one down there somewhere. I can't quite t tell. There is one. I know exactly where one is. We do also have that pig that's up there we need to rescue. But I think he might have actually disappeared. Um, or like died or something. But um, there is a cow. Right there. <laughs> come on cow. You need to come with me. I don't think I've got any wheat on me. But let's see if we can get this cow out of mm. trouble. Uh, right now. Come on dude. I've made a really really good easy way up. Um, that you can you can climb up. Um, I don't know if he even wants to come with me though. That's the issue. Um, hello? Do you not want to? Do you not want to come up? Look, I've got some like nice food up here. I can go find some. I think I've got some wheat somewhere. I might. The chests in here are just a mess. This is how long I've been here. I do actually have some wheat. Look, wait. My inventory is a mess as well, but ooh, good you do. Um, and uh, yeah, he's out. He's out. Yay! Come on, cow. We're gonna go. And uh, become a reindeer. You, he's always wanted to be a reindeer. It's like it's like the squid's always wanted to be a potato. Always wanted to be a potato, even. Um, and uh, the the cow always wanted to be a reindeer. So you know we're gonna make him a reindeer. So we're gonna get these guys over there. I'm sure. I'm sure I will find some more cows somewhere in the future. I'm sure there aren't. There are some that aren't all the way down there because that is a long, long way. But we're gonna get this guy, put him in front of the sleigh, and uh, tie him up or something. Which would be cool. <laughs> okay, well, having gone around everywhere, this is the nearest cow I can get up the mountain. In the kind of easiest, I guess, way. Um, in fact, this is probably going to be an absolute nightmare and I might in fact kill him, which is why I'm recording. Because, you know, killing cows is always a fun thing to put in an episode. Why not? Um, no, but seriously, this guy is going to probably die. Um, because I don't know which way is is the easiest way to get him up here. I should have also cleared my inventory a bit. Oh no, it is a bit clear. That's not too bad. Um, and we're going to make this cow a staircase. <laughs> because he's obviously completely unable to get himself up. Um, so we're going to see when we when we use this weight right here. Um, if he can actually make his way up. Are you following me, dude? No, I think he's just staying there. Um... Okay, right, let's see. Fingers crossed, the AI in Minecraft for cows isn't messed up too much. Um, you're coming. He's, 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 he's coming, guys. Guys. No, he, he freaked out. He just didn't, he didn't like that, whatever the hell happened there. I'm pretty sure I wasn't, I was still in... Ah, come on. Come on. Follow the wheat. No? Come on. I know you want the wheat, dude. Yes. That's it. That's it. He's going to make his way. No. Don't start doing the twiddly thing. No twirls, okay? I know you want to be a ballerina, but today you're going to be a reindeer, okay? Are we good with that? You can be a you can be a ballerina reindeer, if that's even a thing. I need to see some images of that, guys. You need to come up with some cool little artwork for ballet reindeer. No, that's a really bad idea. But this guy is now actually probably here now. He shouldn't die, fingers crossed, um, getting from here to over to the sleigh over there. But um, we're going to take this guy, we're going to hook them up and make them reindeer. And uh, we should be good. We could, in fact, actually breed them rather than having just two, which is a good idea as well. So uh, we'll get on with that, I guess. Well, what we planned didn't exactly go to plan, I guess. <laughs> um, we have added these guys. What? No, you're not meant to go in there. You're meant to be out here. You're meant to be out here looking like reindeer, okay? Um, yeah, well, I think I need to do a bit of training. These guys aren't really prepared to be... Being reindeer, go out there, dude. Please, mm. just please, you go out there, and you also join them, and I'll block this off so you can't actually get in here because that wasn't really the plan. Um, we'll do that. Pow. 
Look, rain day, guys. No, don't go around the outside. You're meant to be at the front here. That's why there's loads of space. Okay, well, that doesn't go really work too well. The other option was was kind of doing something like this, where I like made little pens for everything and made them out here, and each pen would have something in it, which I'm not sure is as nice. These, at least, you know, are, are you know free roam. Uh, they can they can roam freely around the place, um, even though they're reindeer. I don't know. Not quite sure. We need to like get some antlers on them or something. Just imagine, imagine these little horns here, which look amazing. Um, you know, they're very, very nice. But um, you, you know, maybe grow them out a bit. Maybe grow them out. You know, don't have a haircut. Just have a, you know, reindeer. Okay, I don't even know. I'm having a chat with a cow. Um, that is pretty much it for the for the sleigh. I'm really, really happy with it. I just need some ideas for what to do with a reindeer. So feel free to give me some ideas for those guys, or at least the cows. Um, and this is pretty much what it looks like. We've got Santa's little seat up here, which I really, really love. I think it looks awesome. And then his storage and everything down here. And it's just pretty cool. Um, all I need to do now is maybe build one in the sky. I haven't quite decided yet. I may, in fact, give someone a little gift of one next episode. But we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Um, it could, in fact, be something else. But we've got the secret Santa and... Um, you guys will see that at some point in the future. Not sure if it'll be next episode or not. Actually, no, in fact, it will should be Tuesday. Tuesday, you'll see the Secret Santa, so look forward to that. And um, we'll build something awesome. So if you, there is anything you want me to build for my Secret Santa, then uh, let me know in the, in the comments. Secret secret comments. Um, let me know what you want me to build for them. And, um, yeah, I'm pretty excited. I'm not going to say who I've got yet. I've got, I've got a name out of there, and I'm pretty pumped and excited for... For building that for them but you'll see it in the next episode and um let me know in the comments below what you want to see me build and i will probably do it um because i haven't got too many ideas we'll we'll, give, we'll have a bit of a brainstorm session but anyway thank you very much for watching guys um this episode has been a really really fun one to make even though it, i didn't have as much time as maybe my other episodes um i hope you guys really like the slate it's actually kind of one of my favorite builds here now funnily enough um yeah, I wouldn't I wouldn't really normally like this kind of thing, but I really like it. I think the, the bushes here look really, really nice, and I give it just add, this added touch. Also, I actually found some roses, which is what I needed. I needed these. These guys were over there somewhere, um, and it would have been really handy if I had those with bone meal, and I would have been able to have all the red dye in the world, but uh, sadly I didn't. So, anyway, we had enough red... red uh, clay i guess for this and um anyway i'll catch you guys next time uh leave a like if you have enjoyed as always and i shall catch you guys next time see ya